Hello. Yes, that's right. Rebuilding British nationalism will be a walk in the park. Trust me, it will. And I'll tell you why. You see, everything's still in place, isn't it? All our former members are still out there. Voters, supporters, they're all still out there, right? Especially those that live in the white enclaves, the white communities, surrounded by hostile neighbours, they're all still there. We've just got to organise them. In fact, the forgotten and beleaguered white working class, especially in the white enclaves, the white communities, surrounded by hostile neighbours, there's no one else really to turn to except us. You see, Labour's abandoned the white working class in favour of third world immigration, multiculturalism, diversity, bogus equality dogma, and so on and so on. They have abandoned the white working class. And the white working class are not going to turn to the Tories, right, in a million years, right? So there really is only us. Now, if we do make a clean break from the EU and Brexit is delivered, then British nationalism and English nationalism in particular will be going through the roof. And our enemies, they know this only too well. That's why they're planning and scheming and plotting to derail Brexit. They know what's going to happen, right? Uh, Nigel Farage, where does he come into all this if Brexit is delivered? Well, I think that's the end then of Mr Brexit. But what he's achieved is monumental. He'll go down in history, Nigel Farage, without a doubt. But that's where the fight ends. And that's where our fight then really just begins because we know what has to be done, what must be done, or we're going to lose our beloved Great Britain. We can't just get out the EU, which is that. That is a start, a big start, right? We've got to sort out what's happening here in our country. We've got to not only stop uh, immigration coming from Eastern Europe, which I know a lot of people aren't bothered about, but it still waters down the British way of life and our indigenous status, doesn't it? Of course it does. Right, it, it does. But the, the big threat is, is Commonwealth immigration. Right, but I believe uh, if Brexit is honoured, people will demand that uh, Commonwealth immigration now be curbed right down to a few thousand a year if possible. Right, of course, because we'll start demanding more. Right, this is what will happen. And like I say, our enemies know this only too well. So, Regarding Nigel Farage, I think that would be the end of Mr. Brexit. But God bless you, Nigel Farage. You, you're a hero. What you've achieved is, is, is just unbelievable. But I think that's the end then. I don't think you want to really take on the big fight that's ahead. You leave that to us. We'll do that, right? So all we have to do is organise our people. Because like I've said, uh, everything's still in place. All our supporters, voters, former members are all still out there. They just need organising. And like I've said, the Labour Party's abandoned the white working class now. And people like Derek Atten, Tony Mullane, Ricky Tomlinson, even Arthur Scargill, they can see that. They know what's happened. They must hate all this new stuff. Non-binary and transgender and third world immigration. They must hate it privately. But you see, the modern new left is siding with the third world and the freaks to destroy our beloved Great Britain. And you're going along with it, a lot of years, you know. Uh, I mean, gone are the days, which you, you must be going mad. Gone are the days, or all our lads, when you called all the Ford factory workers out, or the dockers, or whoever. They're gone them days now, so your days are numbered, right? It's our time now, once we get our act together. Okay, thank you. Our activity must be geared to the winning of power. That still has to be said to some people in our movement here in America, back in Britain and everywhere else. They are crusaders for the truth, but they don't relate it to the necessities of winning power. It cannot be said enough. Power is what must be won. First, just a little bit of power, then more power, and finally complete power. Activity geared to anything else is a waste of time.